Amon's forces arrived here before we did. The temple may already be under his control. Zeratul believed the other Zelnaga were here, and that they would stand with us against Amon. They could end the war. My people could be free once again. Then why have the Zelnaga not answered us? I am going into the Ulnar Temple alone, Matriarch. I do not intend to risk any more lives. You risk your own life on the word of a traitor. He killed your mother, Vorazun. That is true. But he was never a traitor. I do not wish for death. Only to see Zeratul's visions fulfilled. You will return. That much, I believe. My warriors cannot aid me in the battle ahead. This burden is mine to bear. The Starfighters have arrived, and they await your evaluation. The skies await. It is a good day to die. The skies await. It is a good day to die. Since we arrived here, the Keystone has reacted strangely. It's as if it is attuned to the energies below. Energies below? Yes. Void energies exude from this place. I believe this world is a conduit between dimensions. And the Keystone? Acts as if siphoning these energies. This is entirely different from how the origin point information was stored. As if the Keystone was reconfigured for a second purpose. Let us hope that the Zelnaga themselves can reveal the truths you're looking for. Adun Toridas, Hierarch. Vorazun, I know not what I shall find below, but I know I must go alone. You are in command of the Spear of Adun now. Until you return, Artemis. I have come seeking this Zelnaga.
It seems fate has drawn us together. You should not tempt it further. The shrines call this place the Temple of Unification. The Zelnaga are somewhere within. So far, all I've encountered are hybrid. I've been fighting them for days. Progress has been... difficult. The prophecies foretell of two ascended races, working together to seek out the halls of revelation within the temple. Only with both present will the shrines reveal the means to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. <sighs> I've never cared much for prophecy. And yet, despite our history, here we stand, together. Perhaps you should start. Yes? Change is upon us. Let us make for the shrine. You have my attention. No time. I serve my people. Explain yourself. My search. Our destiny awaits. There can be no doubt. Dawn will come. It seems that... Your queen listens. We shall halt. Do you sense that? A great power awakens within this construct. Purity of form. Purity of essence. Prove your strength. Stay close to me, Kerrigan. My psionic abilities can mend our wounds. You have my attention. Change. There can be no doubt. What you said already. I serve my people. Our destiny awaits. Together, we are strong. So the constructs hold the keys. Good to know. Let us proceed. Our path is clear. These devices emit solar energy. We should gather them. Our knowledge is your heritage. A bold plan. Look out! Hybrid! You have my attention. Explain yourself. Arak and Vyash. Together, we are strong. Another construct. We'll have to destroy it to open the doorway. Make it quick. Speak. A bold plot change is upon us. The future is ours. A key is still missing. What is it? I serve my people. Kerrigan, the construct is coming for you. Your queen listens to Explain. A bold plan. You have my attention. Arak and Vyash. Our path is clear. Make it quick. Dawn will come. I serve my people. Strength. What? Our destiny. Make it. I serve my people. The future is ours. There can be no doubt. Fate is with us. The shrine still functions. There. 
It gathers power. It should be active shortly. Friends of yours? Not quite. It appears Amon's forces have found a way into the temple. We must slay them all. I think I'm starting to like you, Artanis. Assemble the keystone and find our way here. Amon indwells my people, possessing them through the Kala. But he has no physical form. If he were separated from the Templar, he could be forced back into the void. Come on, Artanis. We've still got a long way to go. We shall prevail. The future is ours. Let's go. It won't be long until our enemy pushes further into the temple. With, it seems you were correct. Well then, shall we? Our path is clear. Our destiny is clear. Yes, I am the spirit. Your queen, Lucy. Speak. Plan. You have my 
This passage has caved in as well. Wait. Hybrid. Yes. Make it quick. Our destiny. Dawn will come. Together, we are strong. All Nar shall serve as your tomb. Explain. You will search and destroy. Your quest is destroyed. Make it quick. Strength in unit. Our destiny awaits. Our heritage is your future. With honor, I lead. They're fighting another construct. What is this? Explain this. I serve my people. There can be no doubt. Speak. Change is upon us. We shall prevail. The future is ours. Our path, the Tal'Darim, are breaching into the Hall of Revelation. Ready your blades, Templar. You have my attention. Strength in unity. Yes. Together, we are strong. Barak and Vyash. With all The future is ours. Make it quick. We shall prevail. Our destiny. What is it? Challenge is upon us. Looks like we've earned a breather. You're up, Artanis. The shrines look like they're covered with pictograms. How do you know what they say? Communing with the shrine is more than reading carvings. Each atom of the stone has been placed with meaning, purpose. It was here, from Alnar, that the Zelnaga began to seed the universe with life. They created us, just as they gave life to a numberless assembly of races in other universes. Every time, they observe and identify the potential of their offspring, never interfering. The infinite cycle will always be the same. Two races are destined to emerge. One, pure of essence, an indomitable spirit capable of great change, and one, pure of form, a being capable of vast psionic potential, able to house the essence of a Zelnaga. Purity of essence and form, the Zerg and the Protoss, but if the Zelnaga do not interfere, then it was Awan who uplifted my people. All we thought was the Zelnaga was a lie. Come on, Artanis. We're not far from having some answers. I believe this must be the final hall. Wait. The doors are open. The constructs destroyed. Deliver 
Together, we are strong. of yours have a lot to answer for. Ahead of us, within the Chamber of Ascension, the Zelnaga have slumbered as civilizations grew, fell, and formed again. They will awaken when the two destined races arrive. Then, the elders among them will give their lives to bestow their essence. And pure of form and pure of essence will be reborn as Zelnaga, shepherds of the infinite cycle. So, what do you say? Ready to meet your maker? Indeed. Come. The Chamber of Ascension lies ahead, and our salvation within. Something's not right here.
not so easily broken, Amon. The firstborn shall fear you no longer! Matriarch, there is a massive output of void energy spiking from the temple below. Target the epicenter. Fools? Yes, but that is irrelevant. What is relevant is that Amon has opened a gateway to the void. Dark energies pour from within, and they will burn through your precious leader and any who oppose Amon. I can guide you to Artanas before this fate befalls him. If we are bold, we can stop the Dark God's assault. Am I to believe that the moment you're released, your blade will not be in my back? You waste time. Lower your blades. I am Alarak, first descendant of the Taldarim. Amon has betrayed my people. Retribution will be claimed for this, and if your hierarch survives, he will aid in it. Make your decision. Take us to our tennis. Most wise. I have brought an additional defensive ability online, Matriarch. Please visit the Solar Core to configure it. <laughs> 